Some grains on my mount. Red there on the hardest step to pronounce. So low, bro, I was a metal. That a peasant in Renko del Arroyo. Hey, this is what I see. These alligators want to kill me. But when they become unruly, truly, I hunt ducks and grease on rubber tooly. This game, I tell you, is not in mild. Because once again, it's the call of the wild. Because it's the call of the wild. It's the call of the wild. This song got the bees at half star. It's a call of the wild It's a call of the wild A call of the wild Yeah, yeah, yeah It's a call of the wild 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 Peace and hop Peace and hop It's a call of the wild Peace and hop Peace and hop It's a call of the wild My goodness gracious another beautiful well actually it's actually Tuesday which we usually aren't doing but hey it works we're here Calden uh, Fat Siegel Taven States Ethan Weaver Scar Grayson Daxton Myler Jack Hedrick uh, Dabble Fox Ethan Weaver Woodworking Beagle is here how's it going it's your birthday well right on Daxton yeah, that worked out for you. It's super random that we we're on a Tuesday. Kaz is here. A fire B tape. Right on, man. Gunner Clements is here. How's it going? Fake Outdoorsman. Whoa. Streaming like a chocolate fountain. A chocolate fountain. Oh, yeah. RL Special Nova. Spatial Nova. Nice, nice, nice. Kilo Knight's here as well. Best thing that had happened for me this week is bow streaming, especially my goat died. Oh, your goat died, Hayden. It's awful. What in the world? That's uh, it's just horrible, man. Sorry about that. Let's uh, I tell you what. Like I've uh, maybe described in the uh, title and whatnot, we have a completely untouched Verhonga map uh, at our disposal. Uh, I haven't looked at anything, man. It is completely open to whatever we can find. Um, the only thing I can say is that I haven't played enough to uh, make enough. I've, I've been spending all my money on like tents and tripods. That I still haven't bought a, uh, a class 9 weapon. So I don't have a 338 or a, um, oh, a 300 canning magnum or anything to hunt down uh, Cape Buffalo. So we're just going to have to deal with what we have. 
Um, I do have a 454 Magnum uh, revolver, so we can get rather close to a K Buffalo and take him down with a revolver, but otherwise, we're gonna have to find uh, some other means of taking down some of these guys. Here's a 529 to 584. Not a not a giant by any means, but we'll uh, we'll go after him. Devil Fox High, ready for Friday. I'm ready for Friday too, man. I'm excited. Don't know if you remember, but this is the first time in a while being in the stream. Well, right on, Jack. Absolutely. Well, you know me. I remember everyone. What's up, bro? How's it going? Just watched your car vid. Right on, Croker. Hopefully it was cool. I uh, I certainly enjoyed uh, being there during the day. That was awesome. Let's see if we can just uh, nail this dude straight down. Straight down the middle. If he's going to stare at us. Stare at us straight down the middle, then we might as well try for it. If he ever looks up. 529 to 584 blue wildebeest there. Oh, I don't think we're going to get it, everyone. We're at such a wonky angle. There we go. That'll work as well, I suppose, eh? Went off, uh, went off and, and gave us broadside off that shot there. That worked. <coughs> Cole Starkey, how's it going? Let's get some unicorns, I agree. We got, we got uh, a great many locations to hit up. This is my favorite map in the game, so I'm very excited about it. We've got the 30-06 here. We've got the Sola Keen for old time's sake. And, uh, yeah, I really don't have anything else to say other than that it looks like... No. Huh, that's strange. Oh, there we go. Oh, strange. Let's just do that, huh? Not exactly a perfect, uh, 16 by 9 ratio. Strange. Strange! So many strange things going on! How's my day? My day's quite well. Thanks for asking, Beagle. So we did get that left long right at the right at the start there. Gold 35.4. And then as he uh, went to broadside, we also got a double lung and the spinal cord and just dropped him dead at that point. Darn gold wildebeest. Very pretty, though. That'll work. Just got the game and love it. Quinn's rides right on, man. That's awesome. Blackster is here. How's it going? Is this a server? It is uh, my own single player server? Yeah, sure. Cool cat. Hello, it's me. Anyone could say that. Anyone could say hello, it's me. That's what, that's what makes that great. A great phrase, I guess. Got wildebeest up at the top of the hill here. Let's see what we can find down here. Hopefully something cool. Hopefully something cool. Tell you what, the only thing that could get me tripped up is if we saw like a diamond scrub hair. I'm not prepared for that. So hopefully that doesn't happen. Though I guess if we did find one, that'd be pretty magical. I'd, I could probably go back and find something to uh, take it down. Just started working on myself, joined the local fire, getting better grades in school. Jack, that's awesome. Well, that's awesome to hear, man. Keep at it. Keep at it, my friend. What's your biggest carp in real life? Currently 16 and a half pounds, like you saw in the video, Gunner Clements. When is the fishing plant stream? Wednesdays. Wednesdays are the fishing plant streams. You're not ready for school tomorrow. Oh no, school tomorrow. School starting. Already the end of summer, eh? That's no fun. Eh, that's okay. School's cool, I guess. You get to go see all your friends and whatnot that you didn't get to see the rest of the summer. This is not the time to head here, evidently. There is nothing out here. Well, maybe it's time to go up to the top here. Let's go find out. I'm not sure if I should change the time to 8 o'clock or if I should change it to something else. We're just going to find out, I guess. Still streaming fishing plan tomorrow. That's the plan, yeah. The last few days, I love the new update. Right on. Do you plan on playing any planet fishing later in the stream? No. Every stream we do is one game, man. That is the way we do it. We're not switching sallies. We are play one game Tommy's. I, I don't know. 
It's really late here. 238, my goodness. What's the stream schedule? Usually Monday, Wednesdays, but we had to postpone the one on Monday. It was uh, weirdly timed. Um, I was tired because my brother and I moved in our parents all weekend long, and, uh, and I honestly just wasn't mentally prepared to stream on Monday. So we postponed it. <laughs> well, of course, a, a friend of my wife's also had a, a vehicle uh, emergency, which we had to go help with, which kind of put me back anyway. So, yeah, it was a combination of things. You still have four weeks till school. My goodness. They're going to other middle schools. Oh, no. K&K, &K, that's awesome to hear. There is a uh, a K and K fly fishing in my uh, the town I live in right now. It's cool K and K fishing, K and K fly fishing. Been watching for a couple months. Do you hunt in real life? Yeah, if you saw our um, thirty thousand subscriber video, uh, there were some clips of hunting in real life. Uh, but I I used to have a video. It's I'm not sure where it is now, but it used to have um, lots of pictures and stuff from years past of hunting um if you look for it if you uh if you search on the channel like hunting in real life irl or something like that it might pop up but uh, i'm not i'm truly not sure i know that at one point it for some reason was like taken down or something like that it's super random uh but it just disappeared whoa freaking lion dude we scanned him for a, we had an opportunity to scan him for a second and then uh, then he disappeared into the grasses. Oh, give me there we go level seven. We can uh, we can hit him with the 454 revolver here. Otherwise, well actually I think he's lions are only are they class nine? They might be class nine. Yeah, they are. Okay. So, yeah, it would be a 454 revolver situation. Situation there. We'd have to lob a revolver around at him. How old am I? Because you're 11. I'm a little bit older than that. Just a little bit. Yeah, I'm guessing this is just not a good time to be out here in the bush. Let's change the time to... Oh, I don't know. Let's change the time to... What say ya? Uh, 5 o'clock? 6 o'clock? 7? In the evening? I'm not sure when things are... Uh, I don't have need zones anywhere, so I'm not 100% sure what a good time to be hunting is. Change it to like seven o'clock though. Seven thirty. When are you gonna play Fishing Planet? Well, you know me, man. Ah, uh, seven thirty is too late, evidently. It's already dark by now. I'm always playing Fishing Planet here and there. Are you max level yet? You know, we're not actually. We're only level 33. Which shows you how much time I've put into playing the game, I guess. I've kind of just like lost... I haven't lost all interest in playing the Hunter, but at the same time, like... I don't know, it's not as fun as I used to find it. I think it's because uh, some of the other content creators have gone so like... So crazy on the stuff that they've been doing and like the idea of hunting... 7,000 animals to get one particular animal is just like it really turns me off from playing this game so I don't know I keep going back and forth between thinking like maybe I should just play Fishing Planet until uh, until people uh, I don't know find this game more fun again or something like that but then I think well there are still a lot of people who enjoy this game we might as well play it What's my opinion on Rancho Del Arroyo? I think it's fun map, man. We uh, we started out the uh, beginner series there. It's a great place for beginner players. 
Don't like honey except for turtles. They taste good too. Interesting. Like hunting turtles. How many uh, diamonds do you got in the hunter? I don't know. We've restarted the uh, the game so many times that uh, the codex doesn't really tell us anymore. Um, let's see, where does it say? Yeah, we have we have two on this current playthrough, which I haven't been playing that much, so it doesn't really surprise me. I know on our first playthrough we were at like sixty something, and uh, that was I don't know two years ago. So, I, I'm not sure. I wouldn't think too much higher than that, because I really haven't played too much since then. So is it Suji or Sugi? Just want to make sure I'm saying that right. How's it going? Got a few Cape Buffalo down here. Really, where I was wanting to go is across over here to this tent. Not seeing anything. Well, I guess there could have been some gemmies. Some Gemsbach down in that valley there. But now that we're up here, let's take a look over the side. Should be some more Cape Buffalo feeding, you would think. It's just about getting too dark. Hmm. Well, my goodness. When do you stream Fishing Planet? We stream on Wednesdays. Everybody knows we stream on Wednesdays. Fishing Planet on Wednesdays. Are you ready to fish Call of the Wild? Yes, indeed. Very, very excited about that game. Let's see if it's uh, better in the evening for this spot. Ooh, you know where I do want to go. Let's take, let's take a look over this hill real quick. And if we don't see anything, I have one other spot I want to go to before we uh, switch it to morning. Replay Fishing Planet and watching your videos at the same time and have had a blast. Right on, Dylan, that's awesome. In percentage of minutes. <laughs> uh, bringing on Hunter Call of Wild and not playing Fishing Planet so much. Ah, well, it is what it is, man. We started this channel playing the Hunter Call of the Wild, so maybe it's just the opposite for, for you. Yeah. Well, and we're not necessarily hunting lions per se, but anything in between would be all right. Ooh, that's a good wildebeest, man. 584 to 639. That's a that's a diamond potential wildebeest. Should we uh, figure out where that guy went? Some warthogs down here. Let's sling around at him. But instead, let's go figure out where this wildebeest went. It's kind of exciting. I always love to see 600 pound wildebeest. You see that track, Canter 639. That's uh, that's a diamond diamond potential, man. It doesn't even have to be level five. It could be a level four. We've uh, we've shot our fair uh, fair share of level four diamond wildebeest. Uh, as long as they weigh six thirty nine. Just need to figure out where he went after this need zone. Oh, here's tracks. Going off in this direction. All right, here we go. What's your favorite place to fish on Fishing Planet? I'm not 100% sure. I've got a few different spots, but I get bored of all of them if I don't switch it up, so. Blue Crab's always a fun one, though. Alright, let's take a look at this. I think it's more this way, Bjorn, too. Wish you could just track things that wasn't blood, buddy. Wish you were more of just a track hound in general. Finally made it be down. Hey, right on, man. Glad you did. Here to here to learn. I'm not sure I'm the I'm the greatest 
uh, for doing that, but we'll uh, we'll certainly give it a try. Okay, here's a track. It wasn't straight ahead like we thought it would be. Doesn't seem to be off in that direction. It's kind of strange. He's he's a single wildebeest. So it's it's not like we're getting tripped up by lots of tracks anywhere. And at the same time, like, come on, man. How hard is it to find one track? Should just be straightforward. <laughs> Got our flashlight on just in case that's uh that's an issue with finding him. Thought that bush was something standing there. Come on, where the heck is one track? I think we uh I think we just lost him, I guess. I'm not sure. What does that need zone say? So that's 3 to 6.30. Technically, if we just switch the time... Okay. Let's give this a try. Let's go, uh, let's go change the time. Any diamonds in this stream? You know, in the 20 minutes we've been playing? No, not none, none so far. Oh, scope spines. If only they made it a colorblind mode, it would have been more fun to start out. Oh, okay. Let's, uh, let's try 409A. Eh? Love this map and know exactly where to hunt lions. Right on. I don't spend a lot of time hunting lions. Um, but I don't spend a lot of time hunting anything in particular. I usually just kind of run around and see what I see. But it is what it is. Got done with the football. Glad to see you're alive. Hey, yeah. It's a, it's a rare thing on a Tuesday, but everyone's got to have their days. Okay, so we're here in the time of his need zone. He's not here. Let's go figure out where he could be, I guess. Any golds or diamonds yet? Nothing yet, Sam. We've got a diamond potential. We're just trying to figure out where he is, I guess. Well, I, what do I have? Where do these tracks come from? Okay, we got tracks again. Got another need zone spot. Just need to figure out which one he's at. Got a walk going that way. Canter going towards the need zone. We have tracks over here as well. There's like three different directions he could be going. That one's going towards the need zone as well. So there was one canter heading this direction. Why is this so confusing? Just, just tell me which way he's going. God, you like hunting cape on this map? I do too. I do as well. Just make sure he didn't go down over this hill here. Doesn't look like he went over the hill. At least not without we can see anyway. Oh my god, this is the trickiest wildebeest to track in the game. We don't get a single line of tracks, we just get random tracks going in different directions. Are you okay about what happened yesterday? What 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 are we referring to, Nicole? Big catch is how late are you? Well, the stream started at 7.30, so you are 23 minutes late. But you know what? You showed up at the time that you could, and that's uh, that's all you can ever ask for. Okay, we do have a track. 
continuing to go this way. It does look like the need zone continues over into this meadow as well. Just a big eating need zone. I tell you what, that freaking bush trips me up every time. It looks like a wildebeest just hanging over eating. Alrighty, we're on the trail. He's cantering, but we, we, we've we we've actually got an actual trail this time, which is better than we were before. The access to the main menu will show up there. That's okay. Might as well keep it natural. Skyler, how's it going? Helps me a lot to find... Yep, that is a great way to do it. Thanks, coach. Okay, Bjorn. He's got to be going this way, I guess. Yes, sir. There we go. All right, Doll Nim. Well, good to see you, man. No, this is not the track we wanted to find. Okay, so. Wait, a this could be a different one. Yeah, okay, we're good. We're back on the trail. Back on the trail. Very old, though that's even worse. Enter. Ugh. It went from there to there. Holy crap, this is awful. You ever want water buffalo? Do you ever hunt water buffalo or red deer in Park of Fernando? I did when they first came out. Yeah. Will work for Everglades Tarpon. Oh, probably so, yeah. Yeah, probably so. What the frick, man? Now he's back over here. What is going on with this dude? At least we have him in front of us now. I don't care that the tracking has been absolutely screwy. It's just, it's been all over the place. But we do have a, a warning call of him in front, which is because we have the wind going right towards him now. Perfection, that's what I love to see. This is when I uh, start changing uh, the direction I'm walking towards him and then we don't see him at all. So I, I feel weird sometimes walking directly towards animals when my wind's going directly at them. But the truth is, I'll end up changing it. I'll walk more north. And, and even as I'm walking north, the wind is just continuing to move so that uh, it continues to uh, go right towards him. Um, but I'll end up losing him just because I'll, I'll lose the line that I was on looking at him. Any of your Call of Wild videos before, so I don't know, but have you got a great one? Why didn't you watch Call of Wild videos? Because I was in love with fishing. Understandable, Sam and Caleb. No, uh, we don't usually spend that much time playing video games, so uh, I don't spend time hunting thousands of animals. <laughs> that just kind of, that just hurts my head to think about. I love how we started going north and the wind just changed directions to continue going after him. I'm so confused why so many people are thrown off that we're not playing Fishing Planet. We, we have played Fishing Planet on Wednesdays for years now. We've always played Fishing Planet on Wednesdays. Uh, the only thing that ever changed was on Mondays we would do half and halves. Where we would do half Call of the Wild and half Fishing Planet. But we've always played Fishing Planet on Wednesdays. We had a warning call of him in front of us. Of course, now he's gone again. This freaking wildebeest, dude. 
Where did he go this time? Okay, we got more tracks. Lots of tracks. Got tracks all over the place. Walking. Walking. They're just... They're just everywhere. Okay, we've got a trail of sorts just now. He's going this way. Good deal. We're on the trail. I like hunting buffalo right on. Forgot what day of the week it is. Yep. It is Tuesday. Are you playing Fishing Plant? Guys. <laughs> what? I'm not answering. I'm honestly just going to forget that people ask it. I'm sorry if it feels like I'm ignoring you, but I'm tired of answering the same question over and over again. We play Fishing Planet on Wednesdays. On Wednesdays. If it's not Wednesday, don't ask about it. All right. All right. He's moving. He's moving. Still running that way. Hopefully, if we get to the edge of this hill, might be able to see him down there somewhere. It's those warthogs again. You, you would certainly think that would fin that would do it, Sam and Caleb. You realize that I have a thing that constantly asks people to give likes, right? And, uh, and what do you think people don't do till the end of the stream? They don't give likes. It, it literally comments every 10 minutes telling people to like the video, please. And yet people still don't do it. So, I don't... At that point, I'm just putting forth effort when people aren't going to be listening anyway. We, of course, found a kudu. Oh my god. Of course, he does a warning call. He's like right there. Who do? Where are you, wildebeest? Oh, the hem? No, nope, that's the tree. Thanks, Blackster. Appreciate it. Hello. Hello. So he literally just did a warning call from this tall grass. Kudu's still there. None the wiser. Oh! That's him! He's running away now. At least he's the easiest wildebeest to see in the game. Freaking giant gold one. Unfortunately, he just ran off a long way away, so we're gonna have to catch up to him. <laughs> Luckily, he did just run open into, uh, into an open meadow, so hopefully if we get to the top of this hill over here, we should be able to see him. Unfortunately, the wind is still blowing directly at him. So we're just going to have to uh, hope that our scent spray is working well. When will you go back to Medved? I don't know if we ever will go back to Medved, Caesar. We'll just uh, we'll just have to see what the uh, 
what the game holds for us, maybe. Is it insane and broken? Yeah, I understand. What are you playing on Wednesday? What are you playing on Wednesday? I don't know yet. Fishing planet. <laughs> we'll find out, I guess. Are you excited for the angler? Yes, very excited for the angler. Excited for the angler. Excited to play a new game. I'm uh I'm still waiting for the way of the hunter people to uh give me my early access. Play that game, but otherwise, yeah, just waiting for uh Call of the Wild the Angler to come out. Is that him? No, it's a freaking warning thump from a rabbit. Okay. Okay, wildebeest. Playing games now, huh? Wildebeest wants to play games. I can play games. We're good. Is this the wildebeest tracks? Hopefully. There we go. Back on the trail, everyone. Would have been nice to uh, see him back when. But here we are. Not any better wind-wise. Wind is still going directly at him. But it would be nice to be able to see him before he runs this time. Mr. Soldier Fan, hi. It's really good for lions. They're, uh... The Zarza isn't lion capable. Lions are class nine, but the Zarza is not class nine. So if you shot a if you shot a diamond lion with a Zarza 308, you would not get a diamond, you'd get a gold. It would be demoted. Alright, so we know he's in in front of us now. see anything this is right on the edge of a hill What is the release date for the new hunting game? Um, I'm not really sure. It's coming up though. What is it like the 21st or something like that? <sighs> Dropped him dead. All right, what do we got? What do we got? There he is, 584 to 639 on this mad lad. Cross your paws, Bjorn 2. Oh, it's just a gold, 37.6. Oh, he was .09 away. That's hilarious. Mm, so close to a diamond. .09 away from a diamond. All right, all righty. Well, that was that was a good shot, though. Right in the lungs, man. 
That was, that was really good. 0 0.09. Oh, man. That was close. All right, let's hit up another spot. Hit up another spot. I hope this spot is good in the evening. We'll, we'll find out, though. You get healed fast and smooth. Uh, what's your favorite fish? Mine is the smallmouth buffalo. Oh, really? Mine is the Goliath tiger fish. Board called a lot after 45 minutes because I do it all the time. Uh, yeah, I mean, it happens to me too, but I, uh, I still cruise through it for a live stream. Because I know people enjoy it. People do enjoy this game. I've just kind of reached my breaking point with it. That is to say, like, I, 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 I fish for the same fish for like two hours. So for some reason, I don't know how I don't get bored of that. But, uh, but yeah, I don't know. Some fish planet. Some fish planet is a good question. Can we get a trophy lodge tour? I suppose. I don't know if it's that cool to show off, but I, I can certainly walk through it, I suppose. Everything in my lodge is a rare, a diamond, or 95% of a diamond. So just a really big uh, animal, I guess. Very close to a diamond, so... That's the one cool thing about my lodge. Lodges, I guess. Sidestripe Jackal up here making some noise. We'll see what they're yelping about, I guess. Thinking about talking me out of mug because of the accident. Because of the accident. Well, do what you do, what you do I suppose. That was always kind of a thing. I don't know. You, you got to pick your battles, I guess. Like, I never wanted to do anything that would uh, injure me to, to, you know, hurt me from doing other activities that I liked more, I guess. Like, uh, I don't know. Anything that, uh, let's see, what's, what's a good example? Like, uh, skiing, I guess. Like, we always went skiing, but there was always the possibility that you'd have a knee injury. Knee injuries are pretty uh, common with skiing. And if you injured your knee, then you wouldn't be able to play football. You wouldn't be able to walk around very easy. Um, everything would get harder because of that. And so it was one of those things where, you know, towards, towards uh, you know, the, the big points of my sports career and stuff like that, like, we wouldn't go skiing because it was dangerous. It was dangerous. Don't want to... Take the chance of uh, injuring you, and then you can't uh, can't go on playing football or soccer or whatever it may be. So, but if your main thing is motocross, then you know maybe it's worth it to you. Corlin Hughes, how's it going? Well, unfortunately, there's not really much up here. Hoping we'd see all sorts of stuff, but we have. Springbok making noise in this elephant grass. We had Sidestripe Jackal that were also making noise. Part of my mind just wants to whistle and just shoot them as they run out of this grass. Well, we whistled, but nothing ran out of the grass. Bunch of liars. There's a springbok way over there, though. Fishing kit, I remember everyone. You never have to ask. A life for the awesome day. Well, thanks, K and K. Appreciate it. Need to figure out when the Gemsbok are usually over here. That's when. That's when you're in for uh, the good stuff, man. I'm honestly not sure if this uh, 
rifle is good for coyotes or not. Stop! Just won't scan the ammo! Stop! Moving! Oh, forget it. What's the point of this freaking menu? Nah, it's not good on these. Not good on jackals anyway. Oh well. We'll pick him up real quick. Get to play fishing plan all day now. Yeah. Well, I guess there's always a silver lining, eh? Well, thanks, fishing kid. Appreciate it. You didn't have a mustache. Well, golly. We shot him in the leg. That did it. That that ended him. A crazy looking dog. Alright. That's what you want to do this always think back why you started. Yeah, that's right. Any tips for catching carp on the heron? You know, honestly, I think it's just down to uh, using a feeder rod with some uh, veggies. I think if you use some fe a feeder rod with some veggies, I think you'll uh, I think you'll catch one. I don't know. I've never tried it. Maybe that's something I should try: is catch a catch a carp on the heron. It could be a potential video. I go back and catch a carp on every map leading up. Thing is, I don't think that the carp really give you too good of uh, XP and money until they're uniques. And even then, it's not fantastic. I mean, you're talking... Oh... A 70 pound fish that gives you like 6,500 bucks. Maybe we'll see him if we go over this hill here. Oh, all sorts of springbok tracks. Okay, I see you. One of those black ones up there. Lots of springbok. That level three is the highest level one there, unfortunately. What are you, a little doggy? Little dog sitting there. Is that all that's on this entire hill right now? Sure enough. Well, that's dumb. Okay. Good to know though. Let's go ahead and switch it to morning. I'm uh I'm I'm tired of uh of trying to do this evening hunt. You're stuck at Lone Star Lake, oh no. Hunter Bradley, how's it going? Your first time was in Verhanga. That's awesome. Where are you gonna hunt after Verhanga? I, I don't know. That's pretty far in the future. I don't I don't know. Can't think that far ahead right now. You change your stream day. Yep, we postponed it yesterday. Um, if you saw us post, post it on YouTube and we post it on the Discord every which way that I could post besides putting out a video. So, keep keep everyone up to date is the, uh, is the whole point. If uh, the stream's not at the available time, do a little searching, you'll figure out why. Unless you don't, and then usually I'm dead. Usually, though. Where are you hunting? We're in Leighton Lakes at the moment, hunting for moose and, uh, and bears. There's a warthog way off in the distance. Hmm. Whoa, 
probably hit him twice, but he's not dropping any blood. He's just a tough warthog, I guess. Fishing Planet or the Hunter Call of the Wild? At the moment, I enjoy Fishing Planet more. It used to be back and forth between Fishing Planet and the Hunter Call of the Wild, but I just really can't find the love that I used to have for this game. I struggle playing it, <laughs> but, but I still like to do live streams of it because I know people enjoy watching it. There's some Gemsbok in the trees there. Now, if all goes to plan, they should continue to go up the hill here. So we might be able to cut them off, Bjorn, too. Come on. Come with me, buddy. Single springbok up here. What's your best animal you've shot? We shot two max score, a wildebeest and a springbok here at Rahanga back in the day. Those are the best ones we've shot. Well, that's cool, Caesar. I'm glad you did that. I've been playing the Hunter Call of the Wild since 2017, and after uh, five years going on six, I think anyway, I'm just kind of bored of it now. How am I personally? I'm a little stressed out thinking about this upcoming uh, fishing trip, hoping that everything goes to plan. And until it does, I'm just going to be kind of uh, anxiety induced. But, uh, I'm excited. Usually just find their scat weirdly. It smells like Slim Jims. Yeah, I understand. Yeah, I mean, it is a beef jerky sort of, uh, smell. Um, but no. No, I have not shot, uh, a Bigfoot. A Yeti! Now, if you find a Yeti Bigfoot di different, I have, we have hunted a Yeti. Um, so, you know, it is what it is. If you're one of the type that believe they're the same, then yes, we have we have shot a, a Bigfoot. What's your favorite map in your opinion? This map, Verhonga. That's why I, that's why I chose to play this map is because uh, <laughs> I I wanted to play something that I wouldn't get bored with. <clears throat> Avery, how's it going? Or love sitting with me and watching your videos. Right on, Fat Seagull. Start playing it a lot. Well, cool. This one rainbow trout is bugging me so bad it's been getting hooked and then getting off. Oh, no. I'm going to shoot an abominable snowman. I heard that there's dropping smell like cookies and cream Hershey's bar. Whoa. Whoa. I tell you what. I, uh, you know, anytime I've ever tried to go out for a Yeti, before before the point where I was at, you know, hunting them uh, fairly regularly, um, I would go out there, but I'd always bring a Coca-Cola, you know, just as a refreshment. And, uh, and the hunt would always get thrown off because of polar bears. Polar bears would just appear out of nowhere. They just really have a, uh, a thing for uh, Coca-Cola. So, the hunts would usually get cut short. We have a bunch of Gemsbok in front of us. Fortunately, they're all awful. Don't you think, Bjorn, too? Just kind of took a random shot in the dark there. At least got one of them. All right, all righty, all righty. Should come to Massachusetts to catch big striper. That does sound awesome, Corlin. 
Yeah, I would definitely be game for that. I, uh, I just can't at the moment. Because of, uh, other stuff. <laughs> as, as you can imagine. Level 4 Gemsbach over here making some noise. Oh, he's just a level 3. I don't think he's ever gonna stop. Let's just pick up this gal and then go somewhere else. Alrighty. Um. You gave me gold. Oh no, Phoenix, that's awful. Well, at least you found him. That's what matters, eh? Finding him. Never played Call of the Wild. It looks fun, though. It is pretty fun. Hi, fishing kid. What's up? Where would you love to go in real life for fishing? The Congo. Goliath Tigerfish. If, if, if someone could fund one trip, like a millionaire was just like, Yo, Bo, where do you want to go? I'll pay, I'll pay you to go anywhere. You know, I'll fund the whole trip. Uh, it would be the Congo. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure what Bjorn's up to at the moment. But I do know that you'll see a clip of him during the halftime show, so that'll be fun. <laughs> Call of the Wild, do you think, is the best? Oh, I, I am not entirely sure. I mean, there's lots of DLC that are uh, really good, like uh, necessary DLC, I guess. Um, Four-wheeler DLC, tents DLC, that sort of thing. Um, but as far as reserves, I've always thought Verhongo is my favorite. But I know that other people like... Some people like SRP, uh, Silver Ridge Peaks, in other words. Um... Yeah, people like Parquet Fernando. Other oh, in other places, I guess. Everyone's got their favorite reserve. What's everyone's favorite reserve, I guess? Type type it out. Tell us. We'll get a small poll going on based on how many times we see see the name, I guess. You'd rather go to New Zealand for huge trout? That would be pretty cool. I could catch a trout in New Zealand. Then come to the Congo and catch a Goliath tigerfish on it. As long as it didn't stay, it didn't get too rotten in the time that it took to get there. Best hunting and fishing videos. Love watching and playing the same game. Keep it up. Thanks, Phoenix Gaming. Appreciates it. Oh, I never thought it was since I started watching you on Skittles. That's awesome. Well, I'm glad to hear it. It is a fun game, I agree. You like Mississippi, SRP, Verhonga all day, every day, Silver Ridge, Raviola Coast. Raviola Coast is pretty fun. Yukon, Silver Ridge. You like them all equally. Ooh. Yukon and Silver Ridge Peaks are pretty close together, but I think Silver Ridge is leading by one. Yo, hello, hello, Halloween. How's it going? How did I get so many? Uh, making lots of videos, improving over time. You have to realize we've been doing this for almost four years now, so. Takes time, takes effort, I guess. You, you get better at it as you go on. You get better at making videos. You get better at editing videos. So, I think people get thrown off, you know, as they kind of start making videos. Um, and
and they start to realize like, holy crap, this takes me three hours to edit this video and that's only for one video of the week and I need to make five videos a week or at least three to even, you know, uh, get subscribers or something like that. So I think that's what usually turns people off when they realize how much work it actually takes to uh, get a YouTube channel going. And these days, like, it's not even enough to just, like, you know, when the Hunter Call of the Wild started, it, it, I mean, it honestly was just fine to just go out and hunt, and maybe you get a diamond, and if you got a diamond, like, that was a video that got a thousand plus views. Um, but these days, like, getting a diamond's not even that amazing. It's like Jurassic World seeing a dinosaur, like, people are just like, oh, it's just another animal, basically. So, it's gotten harder over over time. Well, what would you recommend for gators? You know, regular old Zarza 308 usually do it. I think the, the gators only go up to what? Class 7? Class 8? Something like that. Class 7, maybe, with the bears. That Cape Buffalo down here. That's kind of strange. I don't remember them being down here. We're ready with the 454, just in case. Our wind is going directly at them, so that's perfect. Oh, they're running. Three, three, there's an eight mythical. Very strange. I'm not used to seeing Cape Buffalo down here. It's a new one. Fun to see an 8 mythical though. And we got a new uh, need zone. What do we got here? Six. Sixes and sevens always seem to charge you. So I just needed to sling a shot. Needed a try. Let's see if there's a need zone over here to pick up. Then we can always come back here. You're so late, so late. Yeah, buffalo are pretty awesome. You have all of them, which one should you hunt? Oh God, whichever one looks fun to you. For beginners, I always said Rancho Del Arroyo is, is a good one for beginners. But it's uh, just past 8.32 everyone, so that means it's gonna be the halftime show. So enjoy, and we'll be right back. Time show not sponsored by any of these brands. Now take it away, Dwarven. The party hubbards. Well, are you? Support Bo and the BZ Hub by becoming a member today for only two measly doubloons. And if you're feeling extra generous, become a hub lord for only 10 pieces of booty a month. But if you've got treasure bursting from your pockets, become a hub master for only 20 doubloons a month. And that's a great price. And if you ask Bo, he'll say I'm cutting this a little short. What? Wait, is that a hide joke? <laughs> Curse you, Bo! A fast ye matey! A guy! And now, a glimpse back at yesteryear. Look at these freaking guys. We were chasing after the one, and then we saw these guys. There we go, everybody. No freaking way. Alrighty, well, they are moving right now. Gotta make sure I have the right gun. I'm notorious for, uh... Oh, man. I don't know. Freaking dropped him. On the spot. I mean, what can you say? Of course, we can't mat down the grass or anything. Here we go. It is a diamond 994. Boy, they don't get much bigger than that, everybody. 994 diamond, and look at that. <laughs> if, it, you know, it's a good thing we weren't any higher, but if we were a little bit lower, I think we would have got both lungs, so I think it would have worked out. Now, back to your scheduled broadcast. I just wanted to say... Thanks. 
Rido, Rido, Rido. Another side stripe jackal making noise over here. There he is. Still not enough for me to go back and change out my weapons, so we're just gonna keep on going. Samantha's here, how's it going? Yeah, we've done that before, Phoenix Gaming. Back in the day. It's very true. And, and, and that's always been a big thing. You know, you can have a hundred thousand people, but if no one talks to you during the live streams or uh, no one comments, you know, that sort of thing, like, then what's the point? It's all about the people that you meet and uh, enjoying something with other people, I guess, is what makes it fun. A little four over here. There's lots of jackal over here. There's a good spot to use the swim bait in the Amazon River. You know, I'm not really sure, honestly. I never use that lure too much. Uh, I always had it and I'd given it a try a couple times and never caught to you know anything that great So I kind of just stopped using it and used other lures instead You get charged a lot understandable man, that's what they do. That's what they do Some pretty dope people in the Discord, absolutely. Warning calls. Get up this spot pretty good. Let's see if we can uh, go four there. What's a lure that you prefer to use there? Oh golly, I'm not really sure. Poppers, I guess. Good for arapaima. Swim baits. You can uh, you can even catch the uh, trier on swim baits, I believe. It's been a while since I've been there, man. This dude's dying. First stream 117 says, we're right on. Glad you're here. Very true. Absolutely, skills. Alrighty, we're gonna move somewhere else now. How about here? Because all the animals are making noise for you. Whoa, whoa, Avery. I've never considered myself a DJ. <laughs> How's it going, Dana? All right, let's see what we can find down here. Lion? Crazy lions? What are you doing down here, lions? When do you usually stream Fishing Planet? 7.30 p.m. Central on Wednesdays. Like how much you talk to fans. Hey, right on, Caesar. Well, that's uh, that's the whole point of live streams, you know. What's the point? Otherwise, you just make a video if you didn't want to talk to anyone. What's up, Fetsy? Fetsy, what's up, mean? Something you don't see much on YouTube. Well, what's the deal? I think they ought to stop streaming then. Voodoo making noise over here. 
Could you make a noise? Sorry you're late, McMullen Moto. You showed up right on time for when you were supposed to show up. So you did it. Good job. Oh, really? Right on. Nailed it. First try. That is good to hear, Fetsy. Don't mean to brag, but I, uh, I have a pretty good, uh, woo. I have a pretty good run when it comes to, uh, pronouncing people's names correctly. People, people, you know, tell me fairly regularly that a lot of people don't pronounce their names correctly, but I do. And that just, tell you what, if it just doesn't make my mother, uh, uh, previous school teacher happy that she uh, taught me all that reading stuff then boy oh boy I don't know what will <laughs> pretty cool fancy all right he really likes to talk to people and other people on YouTube just not reply to what they say and not respond to them bah what are you saying All right, we got a level three. Is that it? Oh, we got a couple. F oh, there's not a level three. We got two level threes. We got a small level one. All right, all right, all right. Nothing too impressive then, eh? A lot of kudu in one spot, though. Just nothing that great. Oh, they just continue to come out of the grass. Guess we should have led him a little bit more. He's dying. There's Warthog, too. Oh, my, oh, my. We just found a little honey hole of animals now, didn't we? They're all... N not impressive animals. Every single one of them. The highest thing we saw was a level three. What's the deal, Bjorn? Two. What's the deal, huh? What's uh, this? This map. I tell you what. Used to always be impressed with this map. Now we got nothing. Nothing to show for it. Yep, I, I pro probably would. I, once people throw in acronyms, they lose me. Beat down. Making making videos, of course. Are we gonna stream tomorrow? Or are we gonna push it to Thursday? Well, I mean, we try to stream tomorrow unless something crazy were to happen, like it did on Monday, which hopefully it doesn't. So. Should be good to go. Got aminals. Aminals running. Got this need zone here. Seven warthogs. There it is. I was going to say, I'm not sure exactly where it is, but Yorn 2 will find it. One way or another. You know, I honestly don't think I've shot a kudu since they added the true score. Yeah, we shot it too far behind. Dang it. I hear you, bud. We found him, didn't we? Alright, let's go check this little creek down here. Or, uh, inlet, I guess. On the harem, but it's not on the leaderboard. Well, what's the deal? You know, just the other day, I, I caught a pretty darn big largemouth bass. And I didn't get on the leaderboard immediately either. So, sometimes I think it just kind of lags or something like that. It takes a little bit. But eventually, I feel like you'll be put up on there. Because I should have been, like, number 28 in the world or something like that. But it just wasn't showing, so... 
Eh. Always a chance. A long shot. Look forward to your next stream. You do them best and have a consistent schedule. Well, thanks, Caesar. Going to Maryland tomorrow at 6.30 in the morning. Whoa. The land of Mary, eh? Where you go? Why are you going there for? Anything in particular? How you doing, Bo? Just got off work, Travis. Glad to hear it. Um, doing all right. Haven't found anything that special. We found a potential diamond wildebeest. It was not a diamond. It was .09 away. But uh, ever since then, we've just kind of been looking around for other stuff. Haven't found anything yet. When will new fishing plan beginner video be uploaded? Oh golly. At some point. <laughs> oh. I'm at a uh, I'm at a very grindy area right now. I have to work my way up to uh, level 30 for St. Croix. And so I've just kind of been doing that, but because it's just the same thing over and over again, I haven't been putting out any videos for it. So that's just kind of how it's been. That's just kind of how it's been. I bet I put out a uh, poll. It's like a short poll. What was it? I just asked people during a uh, live stream how many videos people would want per area, and uh, and a lot of people said uh, three. So we'll keep it to three, or try try to keep it around three. Let's see. Well, we found tracks for Cape Buffalo, but no Cape Buffalo. Can't wait till the angler comes. I agree. I'm very excited for it as well. Sturgeon catfishing next month. That's awesome, Skittles. What do we got here? Couple of buffs. Couple of buffs. It's Shia LaBeouf. Hello. All right, well, maybe we can sneak up to him and uh, take him down with the old 454, eh? Let's give it a try. On the 31st, it's coming up. Why would you ever want to come to Maryland? <laughs> big old, big old striper, eh? I have no idea. You're my favorite. Oh, you're my favorite, Samantha. There is one buffalo on the other side. Two buffalo on the other side. <gasps> Three buffalo on the other side. Four <laughs> The count just keeps going up. My goodness gracious, there's so many buffalo on the other side. Lee Graham, how's it going? Hope we get that seven. Yeah, we'll, we'll, go, we'll go sneak up to him and get that seven. If anything, we'll charge him and uh, just take him down soldier style. Warlord style. Still calm. Still calm. Sneaking up on him. How about you? I'm doing quite well. Thanks for asking. Look at all these capes. Couple of capes. Everyone loves a couple of capes. Sorry, I had to turn that back on. Attentive. They're attentive now. Guarantee I think it's your fault. You were out in the open. They saw you. Alert. Now it's alert. What you alert for? Nothing going on. Will you ever go ocean fishing? We went uh, we went ocean fishing last year. We put out videos for it. Have you seen it? <laughs> Warzone gamer, hey. Silent and deadly. Oh my god. Finally made another live. How we doing, BZ? Doing quite well. Thanks, man. Appreciates it. Uh, awesome. 
always love to see that. Warning call right now. Got to get over into the uh, to the old forge. Oh, 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 they're running, they're running. There's level seven here. Hope that nothing's coming up behind me. They're running on the other side of the river now. Top notch. Crushed that shoulder blade into the lung there and got the left lung on the second shot too. Top notch. Little seven. Well, seven. Oh, we shot him right in the dome. <laughs> oh, the second one got them. It's kind of hard. I mean, it was a female, so I wasn't really worried about it, but kind of hard to get those uh, straight on shots. How do you get so much money in Fishing Planet? EESS, man. all running over to hit me or are they running I think they're running yep wouldn't be the first time people have asked for that oh how are those both body shots man that first that second one like went right in the shoulder oh god okay how are these not like doing lots of damage Okay, that one was understandable. But those last ones, I don't I don't think so, bud. Okay. Well, that was fun in games. Bunch of Bologna. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. We shot like 17 rounds of this 454 and a, baz a bazillion body shots. Ugh. Guess we gotta get more ammo. Gotta get more ammo. Well, thanks, 117. Appreciate it. Well, that was fun, though. We got a lot of charging in. Just didn't get to uh, shoot, them, shoot them all down. We were using, uh, let's see, hollow points, so not a lot of penetration. We'll get a few more. Just in case. Just in case we see some more, we'll get... We'll be prepared. You know how it is. <clears throat> Cause good fish in there and some family lives there. Oh, very cool. Well, family's, you know, family's important. <laughs> Fishing is meh. <laughs> Shot it eight times? My goodness gracious. And it went down after eight. What's your biggest diamond? Max score. Max score, Springbok, and Wildebeest. Back in the day, max score was a score of 1,000. All scores were out of 1,000, and uh, if you got 1,000, then that was the max. And I have two of them. Well, thanks. Definitely not woodworking beagles alt. <laughs> oh, who could you be, though? If you're not woodworking beagle, then who could you be? I'm 
more Cape Buffalo over there, but nothing crazy, you know? Just, uh... Just a bunch of normals. A bunch of normies. And I'm not after the normies. I'm after the biggins. Every time I see that freaking stand over there, I think it's a lion. Huh, okay, 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 okay. Thinking up ideas, thinking up ideas, boys. Let's go, um... Let's go... Let's try here. Let's see what's over here. You haven't seen me in two months? I think that's exaggeration. You've seen me before that. I recognize your, uh, your, your logo. Trace Keys. Come on, boys. Where are the gemmies? Where are the gemmies? Nothing, man. Have you fished for trout in real life? Yes, we have. You saw the uh, the fishing in um, in Utah video. You know, I feel like people would really benefit from just doing a deep dive over uh, BZ Hub videos. If you ever wonder if we've ever done something, just click on the old magnifying glass on the uh, on the channel. Type it in and see if you find it. Because uh, we've done quite a bit. I think people just kind of forget about it. Six times the 454 until it went down. Six times, eh? No, I know, Trace Keys. I've seen you. The most boring fishing team. <laughs> Could you still catch a terror tarp? Yeah, absolutely. Go out and get one. On your honeymoon, you didn't. What are you talking about? We did two. You liar. You be lying. Why you be lying? Huh? You lying to my face? Straight to my face. On my honeymoon, eh? All right, what do we got here? We got 252. That's a three. That's a sh straight on shot, boys. Freaking dog! What a freaking loser! He was a straight-on shot, and then he decides to lay down like a. <sighs> he made level seventy-five. Very nice. This dude just just sleeping on the ground here. Gotta hit the hay. Have a good rest of your stream, BZ. Right on, Silent and Dadly. Well, glad you could make it. Glad uh, glad to see you here. And thank you so much. Goodness gracious. Two donos during the stream. <laughs> Love it. Thank you so much, man. Have a great one. Uh, yeah, get, get some sleep. Get some Z's. Okay, out of all the Warthog here, the level 5 is the one that's sleeping. What's his- he's supposed to be eating right now, but instead he's laying on the ground sleeping. I'm afraid to shoot him because of that. You have school in the morning! Oh no, Julian. No school in the morning. You just need the mission for it. Well, I have faith in you. You'll get that mission. Before you know it, you'll be missioning all up. Alrighty, what do you guys think? Mike, I take care. A little four moose on your leg right now. Well, you better go get him. What do you guys think? Should we just take a shot at him? It's five diamond for hogs, it is indeed. It is indeed. Now we dropped him. Didn't go 20. Didn't go 20, boys. Furta, let's go! 
This is sick. We're killing it, literally. Ah, oh, isn't that isn't that the reaction you wanted? <laughs> Have two beagle dogs, and my family's thinking about training them to track. Training them to track. Very cool. Got stung by four bees today. Wow. Bee killer? Why are you killing so many bees? Love the stream. When is the next? Tomorrow, Julian. 7.30 p.m. Central. Got big bodied by the bullet. That's what I'm saying, man. All right, let's see it. Let's see it, boys. Got that red hair, don't care, man. Look at that. Oh, Bjorn 2 sneaking, sneaking into the pick there. I love it. Oh, don't move. Oh, Bjorn 2, you were going to be in the pick, man. Trying to get a good, good, good pick, man. It's all about the picks, don't you know? Oh, <laughs> that's a perfect look, Bjorn 2. Oh god, are you serious? Oh my Jesus, I thought the game crashed right there. Diamond boys! Let's see them dance, man! I love how we didn't get a, uh, a dual lung shot, but that works. We did it. We did it! Attacks or demise him. Throw him in. 60. What's the, uh, what's a max score, uh, Warthog, eh? I gotta look it up. Anyone know? 60 is such a solid number. You, it makes you wonder if that's got to be a max score. I don't know. I don't know. It's a good one, though. Good warthog. It was just laying there, minding its own business. Then we came along and shot it. Shot it dead. So that'll work, I guess. Good old, good old male warthog. Squish is here. Well, how are you now? Okay, let's go. Um, let's go to Trophy Lodge. People were asking to go through the trophy lodge, so we'll, we'll do a little, we'll do a quick little tour through the trophy lodge and find a good place for this guy. Glad the game didn't freeze. I am glad as well. <laughs> Taking too many photos will crash the game. Uh, evidently, yeah, used to not be that way. So that's a new one to me. Alrighty, this is the Sasiga Safari Lodge. It'll. Good old capes in here. Good old capes. Good old gemmies. Lots of kudu. Find a good spot for this warthog now. Do, 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 do. Hi Bjorn2, how are you? Alright, so... That one's a gold. So let's, uh, let's take this guy out. So this was actually, back in the day, we, uh... We messed up this warthog somehow. Back in the day, you had to have, like, five... kills or something in a row. And the game messed up and we lost this guy, I, I remember it. But today he's getting replaced by an actual diamond. So that's pretty cool, I guess.
Do something like that, eh? That'll work. No! Why? Stop messing with me right now. Alright. No more of that. Okay, got a diamond warthog here. Top notch. So, like I was saying before, this is a max score springbok. If you are curious what that looks like, this is a max score wildebeest. If you are curious what that looks like. Here's some uh here's some awesome lions and a cave buffalo. Yeah, lots of other cool stuff around here. The dark days of consecutive check. Yeah, exactly. See, I even forgot what it was called. I've just pushed it aside into the uh, depths of my uh, anger, I guess. Beauties. It's an, uh, this safari lodge is just beautiful, isn't it? Got an albino warthog today. Very cool. Be back next stream. Sounds good, Samantha. Glad you could be here. It's I can't wait to catch one. I'm post it in the days. In the days. Very cool. Very cool. Boomba looking awesome. I agree. Let's put that uh, that other one that we put away up here somewhere. Maybe around there. Warthog. Throw that springbok here. Cool. Neato. Symmetry is not there, but that's okay. All right, back to uh, blah 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 blah. Verhonga Savannah. To ca to catch some more fish, to hunt some stuff. For level forty for sturgeon. Um, you know, we showed off a few different things in the sturgeon uh, fishing video. Jake, I'd recommend going and watching it. This is my first time here. Ooh, no big deal. Started playing Fishing Planet again on my laptop, and I 500% blame you. 50% <laughs> of the Fishing Planet app as well. Hey, you know, it's 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 pretty easy to get sucked back into that game. I understand. I, I get it, you know? You don't have to explain to Bo. <laughs> he gets it. Bo gets it. Let's see what we can do here. Did you hunt Naora? Mm, not, not today, anyway. That's, uh... Might be... I'm not sure. It depends on what people want to watch, I guess. After Mississippi's uh, story missions, we're either going to go to um, Te Aurora, Te Aurora, whatever you want to call it, or uh, Raventuli. So, depending upon what people want to watch, could be going to uh, Te Aurora, Te Aurora, something like that. Next, or, uh, or Raventuli. Sounds good, Julian. Sounds good, man. We will uh, certainly try, anyway. Chicken or ribs? I mean, I eat chicken a lot more than ribs, don't get me wrong. But uh, I would rather eat ribs than chicken. It's like asking ice cream or diarrhea. Not really, but I mean, that's kind of how it is. <laughs> it's one thing that sounds amazing versus another thing that's not as good. You weren't here, how many diamonds so far? Just one. We, uh, we had a potential wildebeest in the very beginning, but ended up not being a diamond. Was off by .09. So, we've only got the one spur... No, not Springbok. Uh, the Warthog. About said Springbok for some reason. 
Got a Gemsbok way off in the distance for uh, no apparent reason. I uh, lost a level 5 Gemsbok out here one time. I got so frustrated trying to uh, track him down that I just gave up. I think the stream was at an end at that point anyway, so I just kind of gave up. <laughs> I sleeping. Oh, sleepy goober. All right, all right, I got gotcha. you. Rack of pork ribs while I was there, and then air fried them the next day. So good, my God. Five twenty-nine to five eighty-four. Oh, got me excited when I saw that level four wildebeest there. Let's see if we can uh, land a good shot on this dude. towards me they're like whoa what was that sound let's go investigate basically this savannah police over here oh i saw those horns and i thought maybe be a good one it was just level three. If it was a level four female, then we'd be talking. Then we'd be talking, boys. Warning call, warning call. Very happy place. Friend is a California, he gives me a pack of ribs every once in a while. Every once in a while. Well, I love things every once in a while. I love how they just wandered into this grass here and now we, we, we can't see him at all. Well, let's go get this wildebeest then, I guess, Bjorn 2. No deal daddling. <sighs> Everyone have a good weekend, huh? I haven't asked yet. Stuck on the Medved mission where you have to take a photo of the lynx. Oh. That one, that one can be tricky. I remember I literally got a photo of that lynx and then it like took off like a second or two later. It was, it was almost happenstance that I got it in time or it ran off. That seagull says no. Well, what's going on, seagull? You're in Kentucky with your family. Okay, right on. I am in Kansas with part of my family. Your weekend was good, though, Creaser Colorado says. Good deal. Good deal. Could have been home. <laughs> well, what are you doing, Squish? What were you doing away from home? I tell you, at least this weekend I will be at home, so I can kind of get back, uh, hopefully back on track with my videos. I had to uh, miss the videos for this weekend, uh, helping out my parents. Wow, we were so close to a heart shot on that guy too. You even got a new rod? What? Gosh dang. It's awesome. Oh, where should we go now? Let's go here. We'll travel south, uh, west. See what we can find. You're in your basement on a laptop in a dark room watching BZ Hub. <laughs> you know that's a that's a small dream of mine. When I was growing up, our house was so darn hot all the time that uh, one of the coolest areas in the entire house was the basement 
So my brother and I used to always spend time down in the basement playing Xbox and uh, computer and stuff like that. So it's honestly one of my like short-term goals is that I'd love to get back to uh, to gaming in the basement. This house that I'm in right now doesn't have a basement, so I don't have an option. Oh, it's the uh, medieval dancing song. I'm just shooting this line. What are you? You're a female. Die, lion, die! Oh. It's like, uh... That ghost movie. What's that darn movie called? The, the lions with the lions. Ghosts of something? I thought. Love the gaming too. E E1. E1? Doloy. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. So you can buy a boat in real life? Whoa. That's fancy, man. Well, congrats. Alright, we're gonna skip that song. Ridiculous. Had to babysit eight kids when you wasn't told to. Ain't mature enough to be a Steve's mom from Stranger Things. <laughs> oh, aren't we all? I mean, I'm 28 and I still don't feel mature enough to watch eight kids. <laughs> but I play there every day. Hey. I don't know why it should be a cliche. It's like, it's it's the pinnacle. It's the pinnacle of gaming. As long as it's not your mom's basement. That is that is the stereotype. Which, I mean, technically it was my mom's basement for the longest time, so I don't have anything to say about it. Well, this lake is just a bunch of emptiness, isn't it? Let's, uh, let's go back to the starting one. We're gonna go check out, uh, the lake yonder. Touchy and greasy. Just bought home her eighth child. Eighth child? What is she trying to do? Create an entire baseball team? What's her goal, Squish? Huh? Alrighty. Let's get it going. So I can buy a new boat. Sounds good, Fat Seagull. Way too many kiddos. Way too many kiddos. Maybe if we pick this up, we'll level up. Ooh. 13 minutes left in the stream. Nope. By the time she was your age, Squish, she had five kids, and I'm just like, sounds like she was an overachiever. <laughs> Oh, she was achieving something. Level five down, baby. Well, well, well what level five did you get? Are you level five in Fishing Planet? You gotta, you gotta be more specific, McMullen. Time I lost interest in Call of the Wild, my dad played, and by the time I got back, I was surprised. I had 140,000, lots of skill and perk points. Oh, nice. For the rest of us, I think. Yeah, probably so. I mean, um, my, uh, my wife's sister has two kids, and I think that's enough kids for all of us, too. Let's see. 35 cousins. 
My goodness gracious. Are you uh, secretly a dog or something like that? You just have you have litters in your uh, family instead of just regular children. I mean, honestly, if you were a typing talking dog, it would be pretty amazing. Unless it's Wii Golf, Wii Golf. My dad played a lot of uh, Farming Simulator. When we were little, my dad used to play, like, Mortal Kombat and stuff with me. Um, lots of games on the Sega and stuff like that, but not, not since then. But, uh, being a furry doesn't mean you have to be a dog. Weird relation, I guess. We're, you drew a line and I don't agree with it. <laughs> What's up, Ken? How's it going? gonna find something worthwhile over here Aren't jackals we should have just shot those spring as we were seeing them running they're nervous so we got wind blowing at them as well we'll just keep an eye spy over here if we see that level four again we might drop them There he is. Okay. Six siblings on either side. He doesn't play anymore. Oh, okay. I should say I forgot. Ah. Oh. Since 1994, a.k.a. three minutes ago. <laughs> what in the world is that? Huh? Is it a lion? I think it's a freaking lion. Guess we're gonna find out once we shoot this springbok. a lion you're trying to get little kids over here no way some beginner player is gonna be able to come over to this lake and shoot a lion I don't think we shot him but we did get these spring bucks let's go get them Show yourself, mystery creature. Your third diamond ever, very nice. What did you ever say what it was? Diamond moose, oh, right on, that's awesome. Diamond moose are pretty cool. I like diamond moose. Bigger the rack, better, you know? White tail, okay. Elk, even better. Moose, that's awesome. All right, here's this little level four here. Not even close to a diamond. And that little guy. I, uh, I hear something. I hear something at the door. What are you doing? Huh? Come say hi? Yeah? Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh, oh. Hi! Oh. There we go! What do you think, Razo? Say hi to all the people? Huh? Huh? Tell people what you did today. It was kind of sunny and hot, wasn't it? We stay inside? 
Stayed inside to stay cool. Gotta wait till winter. <laughs> Same thing he always did as a puppy. Ah! Darren, you wanna come say hi? You, you can just barely see him in the hallway. He does not want to come say hi. Also, is trying to figure out where all the people are. Also, got fuzzier. I think he's lost his fuzz. Is that, yeah, you think so, bud? What do you think? You think you're less fuzzy now or more fuzzy? Well, also, is gonna stick around, but Bjorn does not want to come say hi. Too much work to walk in there, exactly. Peasants! I'm not gonna walk in. Alrighty, let's keep hunting here. I'm not exactly sure where we should go now. Just gonna keep going. Oslo is adorable. He's adorable. I, you know. Not really sure why he enjoys coming and uh, and saying hi to everyone. Melinda, thank you for the sub. Lazy doggo, lazy doggo. Yeah, it was kind of dark in the hallway, and he's uh, he's very dark as well. So it's not a surprise that you couldn't see him. Okay, need some animals to come out and play. Anywhere you be. I tell you what, we were, uh, we had a plan and then we completely threw it out the window. We were gonna go to that far north, uh, lodge and then work our way southwest, but instead we did not do that. So we, we got a need zone here. Uh, till 1.30, okay. So here in like 10 minutes, they're gonna get up and start moving. Uh, oh, scrub hair, okay. Cyber 6, the show. I don't know. I'm gonna have to look up uh, images of that, Squish. I, I can't think of it off the top of my head. Wilderbeast, canter in a way. You minutes start. I can't say on the whole way I'll be back next time. Hey, no big deal, Lee Graham. We're gonna be gone here in a few minutes anyway as well. So gotta be ending here at 9:30. So we only got three more minutes. Very old, very old. These acacia trees are nice. Lots of shade. Five eighty four, not a bad wildebeest. Not seeing them out there, though. Big old rock. There they are. Lots of gold ones, goodness gracious. Okay. Uh, let's see. We got two minutes. What should we do for two minutes? Let's just go, go over here, see what we can see off the hill southwest of here. If we see something, we'll shoot it, and if not, we'll end the stream. We'll give it a go, you know. Best effort from here on out. Just a little late, hey, no big deal. Just a few more, few more days. Bjorn looks like my old dog Stella. Well, very cool. What uh, what type of dog was Stella? 
Flintstones, an essential part of the paleo diet. It's, uh, you know, vital, honestly. If, uh, if you could imagine Flintstone vitamins being back in the paleo diet, um, I have no doubt that they would live substantially longer than other people. I don't know about substantially, but I have, I have no doubt that they would live, live longer than other you know, people during the same time period, don't you think? A Norwegian elk dog? Oh my gosh. Well, that's exactly right then. Probably does look very similar. Darn moose dogs. Saw something running up here, but didn't know what it was. It's a uh, oh, it was a Gemswalk actually. Okay. Got one wildebeest running. Scrub hairs making noises. Anything off in the distance? One spring block way off in the distance. Okay. What you doing way off in the distance there, bud? Lee Graham, hey, take care, man. Panther of a wildebeest. Might run into an entire herd of wildebeest as well. Beautiful smallmouth buffalo that you caught. Mr. Mammoth, hey, thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah, we uh, that was a fun day. Hopefully, we're going to a new place on Friday as well. Next, This Friday. Look at you just walking away. Um, so hopefully, we get into some cool fish there as well. That would be awesome. A lion! You told me there were lions here, but I thought you were fibbing. Ah, oh, jeez, that was a bad shot. There's two of them. Really need to get me a more powerful rifle, I believe. I do declare. Alright, alright. We got a spring buck. Springing over here. Not going to be doing any more springing, I guess. Mm. Oh, 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 oh. Another one. Only level two, though. I'm hoping the angler is good. I hope so, too. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> You should hunt moose, it's super fun. You know, uh, I would give it a try, but we don't have any moose in Kansas, unfortunately. So uh, I'll have to pass for now, but maybe Sunday, that'd be uh, that'd be all right. I know that we have uh, good old family friends in Norway that, that uh, get like nine moose tags every year or something like that, so maybe I'll have to go up and bug them sometime. Alrighty, everyone, we're ending it on absolute giant, I understand. Level 3 Springbok, uh, stunning. I get it. It's pretty cool. It has worked wonders on your maps. <laughs> that's awesome. Well, everyone, I think that's going to do it. I hope this was a fun stream for all of you. If it was, obviously hit that like button before it's all over, I guess. Otherwise, not a big deal. See you tomorrow for Fishing Planet at 7.30 uh, to 9.30 p.m. Central. And uh, that ought to do it, everyone. Take care. We'll see you tomorrow, hopefully. And as always, big thanks to Woodworking Beagle and Squish Swim for showing up to uh, moderate. That's always very helpful. Appreciate it. Anyway, take care, everyone. We'll see you next time. And as always, remember... Thank you.